Welcome to the Hunt the Dark Knights channel. Today I have an um, um, mega haul. I went out on Saturday to my usual um, shop and one other shop I went to as well. So here's what I got. Um, not seen most of these. Some one I haven't. One I have seen. Some I haven't. These are all movies and which are you again? Because it's it's a Lego game from Lego Star Wars or Skywalker, Skywalker Saga. So first up we have um, Chuck Norris, The Force of One. Now I think this was um, this is directed by Dick Halligan from Chuck Norris. Pretty good film. I think this came out. In, this came out in nineteen seventy. 1979, yep. And we've got a couple of horror films in here. Yeah, we have um, Amityville 2, The Precision, which came out. Now, this doesn't have the year, but I got this because um, Bart Young recently passed away, so I got this in. Um, yep. I enjoy this in with spooky disc as well. Yeah, that looks scary, this. I've never seen, never seen Amityville 2, the pictures, never seen a fossil one. And following that with Amityville 2, we move on to Amityville 3. Meg Ryan's in this. I know this came out in 1983. Yep. Yep, 1983. Year I was born. So there's the disc. I can trade the disc for um, a fossil one. Got more film. No, it's a force of one. Yeah. Now we're on to. Um, I haven't seen the anime of two or three and a force of one. Right, next we're on to the guest. I always wanted to see this, so I got it. Yeah, the guest. The guest. Dan Stevens and Mika Monroe. This is um, Adam Wingard. Yeah. Look like a big film. It's a thriller. Yep. Big as bold as badass Vanity Fair. Yep. Looks quite a good film. Never seen it. Then next up we've got. Yeah, I can't get that theme song out of my head. Hawaii Five O first season. This is um, all a seven disc collection including all twenty four action pack, season one episodes plus the original TV pilot movie Cocoon, Cocoon, Hawaii Five O first season. It's all got um Jack Ward. <laughs> This came out in, in 68, 1968, yeah. Following this, this is one of my, I haven't seen this, I haven't watched season one before of the original. Sir and Jack Ward. Yeah. Drama and crime. Yeah, and then we move on to another series I, I like. This is, I think this is um, season one. Of Ironside, yep. Has DVD box nine, nine DVDs in it. Yep, it's got disc one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. Then it's got special guests Harrison Ford, David Carradine, and Bruce Lee in it. Yep. Exclusive collection Raymond Barr is at Ironside. Yeah, it's, it's crying. Yeah, twenty four hours to watch. Um, if you watch them all, it takes twenty four hours. Yeah. Next up, we have um, Mission in Action to the beginning. Yeah, I know this because again, I think this is. Mm. 
This is a 1980 so this is another truck door so looks like full disc. I can't choose the disc as the TV series because that would be out getting them all out. Um, and here's another film I haven't seen. This was another truck. I got um, this one more and The Guest and Hawaii Five O, season one, the first season. Yeah. So this is um, Revenge of the Creature. Now this is a Universal horror, nineteen fifty five, and this is black and white. This is um, John Agar, John Bromfield, Warren Nelson. Revenge of the Creature, <laughs> directed by Jack Arnold. Yep. Then we got um. Since I'm a kind kind of a well, I have um I have autism in that. So this is this is called Silent Fall. This is a very good thriller. Yeah, it's, it has um. John Wifko. And also has um. Richard Dreyfus, John Lithgow and J.T. Wilson, Linda Hamilton. Also, this is the first film that Liv Tyler has ever appeared in. Yeah. Next up, yeah, this, this, this film, um, it's just, I never check, um, shop website, what they have. Now, when I was in there, um, I was, I picked up Annadale 2 and 3 obviously, but it's amazing because they never had this on their website. This is t the original Terror Train, Jamie Curtis. And this is a 1980s horror slasher. Yeah. Directed by Winter Spottiswood, who directed to Tomorrow Will Never Die. Terror Train. Yep. Terror Train. Yes, the next two on to a cartoon. Warner Brothers World War II cartoons. Yep, looks quite funny. And I'll show you the game right as well. Yep. This is Wago Star Wars, the Skywalker Saga. I'm a huge Wago fan. Yeah, I've got tons of sets in my other home. And here as well. Yeah. Skywalker Saga. It says all nine films, one new game. Yeah. So, I, don't, I can show you one of the discs of um, Hawaii 5 0 as well. This has got Hawaii 5 0 the first season. This one has got the pilot, Fool 5 and 5, Strangers in Our Own Land. Yeah. Moving forward to zero. <laughs> Sorry, I can't get that theme out of my head. Yeah. Then, um, yeah. I can show you the, um, what is it, the guest DVD? Yeah, the guest DVD, yeah. No, that's the guest. It's a UK film. Which looks quite good. Friday, I might be watching that. Yep, I got some of the films I wanted to see in. Yep. And I don't know if I'm sure that this was Warner, Warner Brothers World War II, two cartoons. I don't know. White Warner Brothers. And I can show you, did I show you, I think I showed you the disc for Silent Ball. Is it this for Silent Ball? Yep. And I didn't think, um, was it Revenge of the Creature? No, that's Revenge of the Creature disc. Looks like a good film. They all look quite good. Now I can show you um, just one of them. Because these are in, the Ironside one is in slip covers. In like old CD pieces. So that's like what they look like. The, the discs. It's about, um, it's like, because they're all in, oh hang on. They're all in different boxes. No, they're, they're in a big box, but it has like box one, box two, and box three. So this has been the London Dark Knight for... What's today's date? It's coming there, um... 
winter time here where I live, where we have to change our clocks. It's Monday, October the 23rd. So I hope you're all doing well on YouTube land. Yeah, on YouTube land. Thanks for um, the recent 635 subscribers. So I have not been uploading. A couple of um, weeks ago I was um, had the flu. Yeah, and thanks for the people's comments. It's always my brother comments. Yeah, he's normally the first one to comment. Since I haven't seen the mysterious commentator. Yeah, there is.